it's yesterday once more. Listen, I, I actually, <clears throat> I actually don't care. I don't care. I, listen, I don't care. I like this song a lot. I absolutely love this song. Matter of fact, I'm emotionally touched by the song. What a powerful song. What a powerful message. I am enthralled by the lyrics. I'm not trying to over-exaggerate. I know I'm drawing every word out. And I'm not trying to, but, but this is a great song. I'm gonna get to the music in a second. Allow me to indulge myself first, for once, in the lyrics and in the message of the song. Okay. I've always said it and I've, I'm going to say it again in this video because I have to. Besides love, besides hate, I absolutely think that one of the strongest emotions that a person can feel is nostalgia. The ability for a sight, a sound, a smell, a taste to take you immediately to a completely different time of your life, a completely different place. This song is founded and built on those memories, on nostalgia, on looking back to yesteryears, perhaps better and simpler times in your life. From the very first verse, Karen says, when I was young, I'd listen to the radio waiting for my favorite songs. Okay, before we even move any further in that, I feel like a lot of us can relate to that. I know that radio now has a less prominent place probably in uh, people looking and exploring music because we have the internet now, okay? I think that a lot of us, and I'm a 90s kid, I'm kind of right in that, right in that median of, you know, old and new. I remember being in the back seat while my parents are driving the car and wait, and you, you would hear like the notes of a song that you really liked. You would hear the beginning note of it and you'd be like, oh, they're playing it. And I didn't, you know, you didn't know necessarily which artist it was. You didn't know <laughs> what the song name was. So you couldn't even tell your parents like, hey, it's this song. Can you like buy this album or whatever? You're a kid, you don't know. But as soon as it starts, your whole night, like your body just lifts. Your emotions just rise. Like there's a strong connection. So just in those first two lines, to be completely honest with you, emotionally, I am sold into this. Been there. When they played, I'd sing alone. It made me smile. Mm. Those were such happy times, and not so long ago. How I wondered where they'd gone. But they're back again, just like. Yesterday once more Each 
Yesterday, once more. That build up again, like even you gotta pay attention to the lyrics that she's saying, man. I think so, so many of us could wish that it was yesterday once more, man. Because I know that we all have a memory back in the past that we wish we could all just take a time, take you know, time travel and just go back to that one memory. And uh, certain songs like bring a lot of memory to certain people, man. Especially when they're younger, like. You have, like, a, if a certain song was playing when a situation happened in your life, uh, if it was positive, man, I guarantee that you will do anything just to, like, go back, go back into that moment and experience that, man. I think that's what makes music so special, man, and what, what, what makes music so great. And, uh, I got, you guys got to also tell me, is she the one playing the drum? Because I heard those drums in the back. I actually never seen her playing the drums before, so if you guys want me to react to a video of her playing the drums, let me know. But oh my God, man, it's such an amazing song. It's such a beautiful voice. Like the Carpenters were legit, like, smashing, man. Like, hits after hits after hits, guys. Wow. It was amazing, man. It's yesterday once more. Such a catchy song, man. Wow, this is a song, guys. I absolutely didn't want it to end. Like, I could sit here in my chair and just, like, listen to her sing on and on and on again. Man, I'm so happy that I discovered the Carpenters, guys. I'm so happy I'm discovering, like, a lot of these great bands and great artists, man. Because, uh... Honestly, if I didn't have this YouTube ch YouTube channel, I would have never knew or heard any of these artists, man. I probably would have heard them, but I wouldn't even recognize who it was. I really paid attention to who it was, man. And uh, yeah, guys, I just want to say thank you for putting putting me on to the Carpenters, man. Ex extremely talented band. Uh, rest in peace to Karen Carpenter, man. It's just tragic, sad what happened to her. Uh, but she left a lot of great memories from these songs, man, that we could all go back and just sit back and just like listen to. When I was about six, seven, eight years old, I used to go to my um, to my favorite auntie's place, and um, she was um she was a very very hip and very chic auntie because um she was very she traveled all over the world. She was an air hostess, you know. She met famous people and everything, right? You know, and she had a fantastic music collection, and. She used to play this song, right? Now, I don't remember the, um, 
the uh, the verse or whatever you know but i remember that every shallow la 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 every woe and as soon as that came on right i just saw my auntie i swear i thought the song was called every shallow la 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 <laughs> you know incredibly this is that song today i cannot believe it guys it's crazy man this is just amazing <laughs> amazing beautiful